appear weak when you are strong, and strong when you are weak. Can you imagine what I would do if I could do all I can? If you know the enemy and know yourself you need not fear the results of a hundred battles. Keep your friends close, your enemies even closer. Know thyself, know thy enemy. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. The supreme art of war is to subdue the enemy without fighting. Let your plans be dark and as impenetrable as night, and when you move, fall like a thunderbolt. If you are far from the enemy, make him believe you are near. Victorious warriors win first and then go to war, while defeated warriors go to war first and then seek to win. In the midst of chaos, there is also opportunity. Victory comes from finding opportunities and problems. If the mind is willing, the flesh could go on and on without many things. Even the finest sword plunged into salt water will eventually rust. A wise general makes a point of foraging of the enemy. The greatest victory is that which requires no battle. There is no instance of a nation benefiting from prolonged warfare. It is more important to outthink your enemy than to outfight him. Move swift as the wind and closely formed as the wood. Attack like the fire and be still as the mountain. He will win who knows when to fight and when not to fight. He will win who, prepared himself, waits to take the enemy unprepared. There is no instance of a country having benefited from prolonged warfare.